Mr. Winshaw, was he was it right for him to uh, was it did he resign or did he get fired? He, he was made to resign, so basically got sacked. So yeah, uh, was it right for the outcome of what happened to Hell him? Hell yes! Alright, okay. why is he even a football player? It's a disrespect to footballers, it's including guy, myself. Semi, I'm a, a pro. semi-professional. No, Let's be real. Listen, that is that's more than I can say for millions of players in this country that don't get near near and uh, 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 close close to where he got to. This guy played for Sutton United. I know they're not really. really Fair play, they're, they're not really a big team right they now. They play on Astro Tour, bro. <laughs> listen, <laughs> listen, listen. That team, he plays for a team where footballers get paid to play. Let's keep it real, yeah? But he, he, he probably gets about like £250 a week. That's listen, whether he got £100, £50, and he's probably, he's probably a janitor as he well. Got play. This, that means he was on contract. That means he was on contract to play for this team. I think it's ridiculous he was even a footballer. The Sutton, the Sutton goalie, right? The Sutton goalie, he does many more jobs than just a reserve team goalkeeper. He also I, 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 he does he maintains the pitch. I don't know if he like he, he does a lot of work. I, I heard he actually well. lives at Sutton's ground, <laughs> so he's got a lot of love. And no one was talking about the Sutton goalie until the Arsenal game. Why was no one saying anything about his weight? Two years ago, a year ago. Yeah, because he what? came into line like now because he was playing Arsenal. So why does it affect? But why does it affect everyone that the Sutton goalkeeper now? Oh, he's eight up high. He's in the wrong. Well, if he was doing that the whole time, what was? What, why is it now? I wrong? don't know if he was doing that the whole time. Fat guy doing well in life, you know, sitting on the bench. Uh, you know, he's got his own job. He's moving the pitch. He's probably getting a, a grand a week for it. I don't know what he's getting, but people are jealous, and that's why they don't want him to do well. So for me. Uh, he should have stayed at the club. I, I think the club were out of order for what they did, and people that want to slate him are just jealous. And I don't, you know, he's good look, maybe he's better looking than the people as well. I don't know. You got to show a level of professionalism. You don't come of course. With this as their second of keeper. Which no, means, of course. Look, let's talk about it. yesterday. The Sun keeper got injured. They had no keeper. Their right back went in the in, in field. Who's not even a right back? He's fat. He doesn't even have to play football. Uh, he went and got. Yeah. He's dead as well. They couldn't even have a keeper. So no, but the thing is, I why, no, 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 wait, hold on, hold on. My point to you is then. When Sutton played Arsenal, let's remember this, the three substitutes had already been made. So how does it affect the game and his professionalism if he's eating a pie once all subs have been done? The way it can't affect no, the game. No, the way, it doesn't affect the game. He takes football as a joke. No, 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 but the way how it, how it, it, it doesn't affect the game at all. What it affects is the FA. Got his image. They've got rules. No, they've got rules. No, no, show me the FA in the rules where it says can't eat a pie during the game. That guy. No, it doesn't say that as such, but what it does have is that it has very explicit rules about betting. <laughs> Does that mean I'm right? <laughs> I don't even know what that means! I'm not jealous. Like, in, in, in regards to. Hey, he's better looking than me, I think. Yeah, personally, but. I don't know. But, nah, in terms of. Uh, in terms of him being sacked because of the pie and thing, I think it's a bit harsh. I do agree with that. But I think what I, what I always said was that him being a footballer was, was, a, was a disrespect to football as a game, personally. I, I'm not, I'm not going to. I never want to take away someone's, someone's, someone's craft and someone's hustle. But. Lawrence, I don't know who, who is this guy, bro. He's crazy, man. <laughs> the fact of the matter is, apparently, this guy made a lot of money from that betting thing. And he knew what he was doing. Whoa, 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 whoa. Let's remember, let's remember that. Apparently, we don't know. We remember that was a key word. Apparently. We don't know. We don't know. So that guy, did he, did he make any money? Did he make any money? <laughs> Maybe That's friends of his. Do you know what? I Maybe think he embarrassed fat people everywhere, I'm telling you. Stereotypical fat guy eating on a bench. If I was listen, fat, I'd be, I'd be angry with him. Listen, even us, yeah? What about the betting? Yeah, the, no, the, the betting, betting, betting thing is ridiculous. Look, I personally see it as a lose-lose situation. The fact that it came out in the news that there was a bet saying that he was going to eat. And he knew about and it. And he knew about it. So therefore, he contra- he, what he did, there was a contravention yeah, of the betting exactly. rules. Exactly. So I personally think... Should he have got sacked? I don't know. He should have got fined by the FA, but does he make enough money I to get fined? I feel it's a bit hard. I feel like something will basically... I think they're trying to look out for a way out of getting, getting rid of him anyway. Whether he was... Part of the club, part of their spine, whatever you want to call it. Yeah, I think it's a bit harsh for him getting sacked, simply because other guys are pro, semi, semi-pro football, so he probably doesn't make much money anyway. But rules are rules. He, he went against the um, FA's betting rules. Should have got fined, to be honest with you. But seconds, all right, it's fine. I'm, I'm not, I'm not against it too tough. Again, again, we're making, we're making a lot of assumptions. We don't know if his friends or he got paid off for that. You can't, we're, what we're doing is, when you're assuming, you're making an ass out of yourself and you're making an ass out of me. We can't be assuming, <laughs> we can't assume these well, the, the Sun newspaper, which is a very credible newspaper. <laughs> the worst newspaper! My God. Listen, all I'm saying is, it couldn't have affected 
affected the game. The three subs were made. He was hungry. He probably been working <laughs> out all day. He probably been working. He probably been at something. Did they say? Did they say? He probably mowing the. Did they send him to a mower? He's not mowing. He's hoovering the carpet. They sent him to a mower. Make sure the kits are on the things right. You know, he's doing loads of jobs. He was hungry. It's nine thirty at night. Is he not allowed to work? He's allowed to work. We're not doing it. No, no, but no, he's right. They closed down. The manager might send him to a mower. Trust me, I know. <laughs> <laughs> they closed down at a certain time. The manager might have sent him to warm up and he might have got a bit hungry running around. Why is he warming up? Three subs to be made. Listen, he's done, he's done. Listen, all right, cool. So let's get back to it. So do you think he was, do you think it's about, I don't even know what the question was. Bro. Should he have got sacked? Yes, I say yes. Personally, yes. For eating, even, for eating a pie, that's even. very harsh, mate. That's very harsh. There's the footballers that eat those little chocolate bars at the half time and that. Same thing, man. Jack Fix, Rio Ferdinand. Yeah, but those are he, like just likes, he just likes pies, he's a pie. But there was a bet on for him to eat a pie, but saying that... It looks a bit dodgy. Uh, it, obviously, to some people, it looks dodgy. To me, I, you know, I think that he's been at the club but a long time. But should another fan suffice, suffice though? It's the same situation as Ranieri. Right? <coughs> it's about, about sentiment. Like, yeah. They should have found him two hundred and fifty pounds. I, I, I do feel it's a bit harsh, but obviously in football in terms, yeah, he shouldn't be at a club. Period. Done. Like, not even for a job. 